Saturday. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Char and I post content related to lifestyle. Let me turn my air conditioning down. I post lifestyle content on Wednesdays and Saturdays at 10 a.m. Please Central Time. Please click the subscribe button down below if you're interested in lifestyle content. Oh, if you're interested in lifestyle content. Um, also, turn on your bell notification so you never miss a video from me. Um, I forgot to do this before I left out of the house today, but I am out and about. I was hoping to get some, you know, some stuff done on my car. I wanted to get like a speaker or something to elevate the bass in my car because the factory audio is not, it's not given. <laughs> but I just went to one um, audio spot and they're telling me that I need like a subwoofer in my trunk and that's going to be like $1,500 and I'm like bro I came out of the house expecting to spend $500 and I thought that was a little at the top of my budget so I'm like what the hell if y'all know anything about cars I have like these speakers that are in here already that I was hoping that you know could be replaced to at um to add more bass but obviously I was wrong but if I'm not wrong let me know in the comments I don't know I need second third and fourth opinions but yeah so now I am getting ready to take some curtains back I, I finally was able to pick up the Hil Hilja curtains from Ikea but I do not like them so I'm gonna stick with the Ritva so I need to go get one more set of Ritva panels for the uh, living room because I'm still not finished with my living room curtains. Um, and then I'm going to go and find things. So like I want to find a rectangular mirror because I want to try a rectangle and circle for my entryway table. I'm going to accessorize the entryway table and then I want to go to like Crate and Barrel, West Elm, CB2 to see if I can find um, a bench for my entryway and then my entryway will be finished finally. So I will catch up with y'all later as I'm out and about. Hopefully I get to do something interesting today. Um, yeah, so I will, I just wanted to pop in really quick. Um, thank you guys so much always for joining me here and I will talk to y'all later. How do we feel about this for the entryway? table I was thinking maybe to get something that's more that color but I like it to be matte I really like this though I don't know so you're looking at my floor because I'm starting this video today because I need to get myself organized so bam Y'all yeah, saw, so if you follow me on Instagram, you saw that I came home from my trip the other day and my bed was all nice and neat. There was no clothes anywhere. But of course, when you travel, I anyway, I immediately take my clothes out of my luggage and wash them. So now the laundry is on my bed. And I figured the only way that I would be able to get this um, completed is if I make it content. So I'm going to finish um putting away my the laundry that's on the bed and let me show y'all something else don't judge so um since i have my closet i have not been keeping it up together except for the shoes of course the shoes stay together but everything is just everywhere like i have all of the space here because i have not put clothes away every time i use them this is from like the last load of laundry. I just threw all of my gym stuff right there because this is a gym section and like it's just stuff everywhere. So I'm going to, I don't even know what's clean and what's dirty in that pile of clothes. So I'm going to have to wash them all now. Um, but I am going to finish my laundry, try to organize my closet a little bit more, and then I'll come back and show you guys. Uh, the update. So one of the updates I can show you really quick is I decided to go ahead and move my shoes that were over here in this corner, like my boots and stuff. So I decided to move them over here. So like, I feel, I figure I have enough room for sneakers. Um, so I'm gonna like adjust these shelves. So my boots, like 
these pair of boots right here are like hanging over and then up here these boots are kind of like too small so i'm gonna adjust the height of the shelves so that i can at least put my boots in comfortably and then i will just i guess show y'all the update to the closet but like i said i'm using this as accountability so that i can get rid of stuff like that put away all of my gym stuff and just organize my closet again um because i need to get the laundry off the bed so i can go to sleep yes it is in the middle of the day the sun is out but sis want to take a nap i'm a nap girl now anyway i'll show my face in the next clip so i will see you guys later So y'all should know me by now and I'm all over the place when I'm doing stuff. So I'm still doing this. This stuff's new pile of stuff is on the bed, but I'm still doing this. I'm still um, working on the closet, but I had like an epiphany like, oh, that mirror probably would be better in the living room. I had it in the living room at first. Then now I put it back in the living room because I was like trying to figure out what I was going to do with that big space on the wall. Let me show y'all what I'm talking about. Okay. So y'all see my mirror is right here it used to be where i'm standing at in the hallway outside my bedroom um i don't know if i told y'all but i picked this up because it's just not working out that me and this rug which makes me sad um i'm actually gonna get it cleaned and i'm gonna give it to my sister so but what we're here to talk about in this quick little clip is it's dark because it seems like it's about to start raining anyway um i decided to move the mirror back here because this is where it was when I first moved in or when I first bought the mirror because I felt like this hallway deserves like its own like moment and I wanted to bring that art that's in my office out of my office look at MJ what are you doing Anyway, <laughs> I wanted to bring the art that's in my office out of my office and throughout the house so I put this one here let's see turn the light on so y'all can see so i put this one here and i am going to get like a small little table or a cabinet or something to put here i just got to be careful that it's not too wide uh just something to add additional decor maybe i'll put like some ottomans or something. i don't know but i wanted to get this art put here so that means this art is going to come down and I'm thinking I'm going to put this one in the guest room. Um, and then there's another piece of art that is in my office. Let me show y'all. So like with any journey, things evolve and things change and I'm re completely revamping my office and I want it to be pretty neutral um, colors and stuff. So I will be taking this last piece of art down and putting it somewhere in the house as well. And then um, I'm getting rid of this desk. 
I am going to be getting a new desk in the next few months, maybe several months. I don't know because I have priorities elsewhere, but I'm going to, my office is going to be more neutral instead of like white. So the desk is white. That little thing I just added in here is white, but I'm thinking I will put that in the, um, in the closet somewhere because this is just my makeup. Um, let me know if y'all want to see my little baby makeup collection. Um, but I am going to get that, this bleached wood desk from West Elm. And I'm probably going to get a neutral rug in here, uh, to replace this one, something more solid. And then behind my desk, I want to have like some more neutral prints or some kind of art that's like a little bit longer. I'm going to change out my whiteboard to be a longer whiteboard, but the one that's like completely clear. And then I'm going to take this uh, poster down and do something with it. I want to put a mirror right here. So, and I'm thinking I'm going to move this TV from on this wall to over here on this wall so that this side can be like my whiteboard nook and then the tv can be on this side uh so i don't know but this is gonna be something that i do over the next several months probably not even um this year i don't know but that is the the um the thoughts process right now so yeah so i'm gonna be removing that i have to remove it by tomorrow because i don't want to have one um piece of art in front, I mean, behind my desk while I'm on meetings. Uh, but yeah, so that that was the motivation for me to remove that art, I mean, that mirror and put that art in place of that mirror and now I have this mirror in the living room, which mirrors always open up the space a lot more. So yeah. Anyway, that's all I wanted to tell y'all, bye. Oh wait, oh wait, there's one more thing. So. I have these two prints right here from Michael's senior year of high school. And that one there is his graduation picture. That's the two of us on his graduation day. And this one was when he was recognized uh, by the school district. So I'm thinking I'm gonna take those out and put them somewhere else. And then I'm gonna, or maybe I'll just leave them in there. Um, things and put them in my office i don't know i don't know i might put these in my office because they're it goes more along with you know things that you do in the office work school whatever so but i will be adding images here and it will be our college graduation pictures so i think i'm gonna get like uh our diplomas some kind of thing to put our diplomas in a picture in the middle and then um just like a quote from each of us underneath just to be like cute. We did this together, kind of, sort of. Anyway, all right, y'all, that's it now, bye. Good morning, you guys. How are you? I hope you're well. So it is Wednesday and the video has not been posted yet. I think I'm probably gonna post it tomorrow. So it's gonna be delayed a day because I have someone coming in about an hour to install my pendant lights. And I it was just gonna be a day late so i figured i would wait until that is done and have that be a part of this video so i'm watching the door because i'm waiting for them to like ring the doorbell at any minute i'm gonna see if i can get his approval to let me record the process so that i can include that as well i don't know how much of it you'll be able to see in terms of like instructional if you're trying to do it yourself Obviously, I don't recommend electrical work be done DIY unless you're like experienced or whatever. But yeah, so I am going to post this video tomorrow, Thursday at 10 a.m. because I want to include this footage. So I will see you guys later. Okay, you guys, welcome back. So the uh, pendant lights are installed and I want to share with you the reveal of them. So... Hold on one second and I'll turn you guys around. All right, y'all. So here they are. My pendant lights have been installed and they are, of course, going to be linked in the description box below. Ignore the dishes in my sink. 
Um, but these are from an Etsy shop called Iron Steel or something like that. Um, these are matte black. I'm just going to take the camera off. All right, you guys. First of all, I'm holding the camera in my hand, so it's probably going to be a little bit wobbly. But these are the pendant lights. Here's a close-up. They are matte black. Of course, they have like a matte black um, um, covering or whatever. And then on the inside, they are... Let me turn the light off so you can see. On the inside, they are this beautiful bronze color and like I said I wanted this bronze to add a little bit more warmth into my living or my uh, kitchen area I'm trying to turn a find a perfect lighting okay um so this bronze inlay is kind of shiny but it's still matte at the same time um and then there's like a ceramic Encasing for the light bulb. There, it's just very pretty. And this time I got a very fantastic task rabbit to install them. Um, and he did an excellent job. He also came in and tightened my faucet. So it's not as wobbly, but it's still not 100% stable. So he's going to come back and do like my ceiling fans and some other stuff in the house. And he'll help me get that situated as well. So yes, I am absolutely happy with the way these turned out. I'm just so thrilled with the way that these turned out and the fact that you know, I found someone that is going to be consistent in the work around my house. So, yes, y'all let me know what y'all think.